Hey guys, Channel Cat Chaser coming at ya. It's been a little while, but here I am. Uh, got a little package. I don't remember when I got this. A couple days ago from uh, Strike Industries. You guys know I'm a big Strike Industries fan. I'm a fanboy. Uh, I like their products. They got some kick-ass products for you know reasonable price. But I picked up a couple things for uh, Metham's AR build. You know, he's wanting somebody to buy him some fucking parts. So I bought him one of these here new Fang Billet Aluminum Trigger Guards. And this thing's pretty slick. I got a polymer version on my uh, AR pistol, but I figured I'd buy a Metham the, the Billet Aluminum one because it's a little bit nicer. And it's all screws. You don't have to jack around and put, uh, you know, roll pins and what, what not in there. Pretty nice. Uh, you can kind of see it in there. I'm not going to dig it out. That's just what kind of asshole I am. But yeah, pretty nice. Uh, I like it. They got another one. It's kind of got like wings on the sides of the thing where you can rest your finger. You know, trigger control, finger, you know, trigger finger control or whatnot. You know, you get my drift. But uh, yeah, I really like this product. It's pretty nice. So, on with the biggest disappointment there was. Now, uh, Strike Industries, I don't know if I know what I'm talking about. But I'll tell you what, you don't know a fucking thing about making a cell phone case. <laughs> That's what I do know. Yeah, this is a Strike Industries. Galaxy S8 cell phone case. This is the the worst piece of shit that I've ever bought in my life. It feels so fucking cheap. But yeah, this is the Trimax 360 degrees of protection. It's fat fucking ass it is. It ain't worth a damn, guys. It's cheap feeling. It's I've got a Pelican case I bought with my S8. Uh, I had to get an S8 because mostly outdoors, you know, he's got one. I figured I'd have to keep up with his skinny little ass. So uh, I went and got me an S8 so your videos would be better, you know, and all that shit. But, yeah, don't waste your freaking money on a Strike Industries phone case because... They're geronetic. They they suck ball sacks. So sorry, Strike Industries. Stick to something you fucking know and make AR parts. I'm not horny like everybody else on that fucking Russia AK bandwagon. I'm not fucking getting on that. Uh, I would like to have a AK, but if I bought one, it ain't gonna be no fucking Vepper or nothing like that. That's too fucking much money for my my tight ass. I'm going to buy a Wasser or something like that because the old boy that, you know, does all those tests on the uh, AKs, I mean, that fucking Wasser kept up with all those high high dollar brands. So, we'll just get us a cheap old Wasser, the old horny the horny Wasser or whatever <laughs> whatever the AK Union said or whatever the fuck AK47 Union or whatever the hell but uh, yeah, Wasser baby, that's what I'd buy. But I don't plan on buying any of it. I'm planning on building a AR, AK, whatever they call it, AR forty seven. I missed out on a fucking a good deal on a uh, seven six two by thirty nine bolt carrier group from. I think it was uh yeah, Primary Arms like fifty bucks, and I sent a picture to Meth and I was like. Man, here that's a good deal. And then I jacked around and didn't fucking order it, and now I missed out. So, yeah, fifty bucks for a bolt carrier, and I'm not gonna put a bunch of money into the fucking thing, because we all know that seven six two by thirty nine. That that thing, they're not, you know, super accurate rounds. It's not a, it's nothing like a, you know, a target round or nothing. So any build you did with a seven six two by thirty nine. As long as it freaking remotely hit uh, one of those paper plates that 
Big Johnson uses as targets. You know, that fucker, I feel like, you know, the YouTube community owes him. You know, maybe we ought to go all, all go together and uh, maybe buy him a, another stack of paper plates or some nice targets or some shit. Because he's got all these CZ pistols, you know. The fucking CZ Mafia, you know, they, they rock, dude. They're rocking some some expensive fucking hardware and you know that it's expensive when you're fucking dragging your fucking wife's paper plates to the range to shoot <laughs> but anyway fuckers uh that's it for me guys thanks for watching keep on subscribing i hope everybody's doing well out there and uh we'll catch your fat asses next time channel cat out